go. Three seconds can feel like an eternity, and now I'm sure Kha'Zix is regretting flashing so soon into the back door. Ladies and gentlemen, today's episode features some stupidly close base race calls. Make sure you're subscribed if you haven't already, and leave a like if you enjoy. Let's hop right back in with Self Destruction's supreme display of defense. We're 37 minutes in and Icade is a full 6 items and Ornn upgraded. This headshot bursts Azir and we don't see him for the rest of the fight because he's trying to navigate around mid to push this wave. Meanwhile, this is the river and not the base, but if Icade goes down here, it's game for sure. Can you finish him? I can oh, silence. No, if I got, I got a game, I got trapped. Oh my god, barrel. He flashed. No flash, AP. I flash. Oh my god, I can't see him. <laughs> Azir is ending. Nice. Nice. Yeah, you're not. See? You can get the dragon. I got I got pissed. Nice, you're Ah! Ah! Okay, okay, we're fine. That's soul too. Oh my god. If there's anyone who can stall out a game, it's the undying rage that is Trindomir. Every crit is an extra spin, which with Hydra is a ton of AoE damage. And now Nami is fully healed with ult up to help stall the death timers. Oh, 200! I can't wave throw all this, though. Or can I? I knew it, Elevator. 
That was a fully Baron empowered team right there, and Night Hour didn't even have IE yet. These tides are looking like they're returning. Next up, no Nexus Towers, no problem. It looks like Trinomir and Kindred sacrificed themselves for the Chemtech Soul, and Bubble Tea is looking to avenge them. I am dead. Kha'Zix is back here, he's coming in one second, idiot. Kha'Zix is coming up. No, George! There he is. Go back in. <laughs> Go back in. That was the fattest clutch of my career! What was that? What was that? The cool was nice this weekend ends. Hit next to guys. Sorry, split. Should be over. I hope. Guys? Guys, can you hit that Nexus already, please? <laughs> yeah. Jiggle's Jungle Gnar is 18 kills and 6 damage items deep. If there's someone who can 1v9 this fight, it's him, because Jin's not doing anything but firing bullets into the wind wall. Trying, I'm really trying. Ah, come on! Go, go, go! It's like, why are you blaming me? My back. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Heal me. Darius gets a full Noxian White either through full passive stacks or a successful dunk, so Charles sees the Xerath and all he sees from then on is red. Full Noxian Might at level 18 is plus 230 AD, so 2v5 feels like Darius could truly 1v9. Wamem has basically just chrono shifted his whole nexus with those multi stun bombas. Next up, our Kale is finally scaling up, and now is not the time to falter. Once Riftmaker gets ramping, watch the numbers go to that beautiful tri colored red, white, and blue.
There we go. Big. Ignore the Tristana farming blue on the other side of the map. Zyra and Darius are here to save the day, and watch for this gorgeous buffer on the Apprehend to set up Zyra's full combo. Next up, as the space defense begins, take a look at the other side of the map. What's the timers? Two timers? Two seconds? They could end. They could end. They could end. They could end. They don't have them anywhere. Oh, oh they have them anywhere. Oh my god. Hey. Oh, that's a great play. He oh, hit the so Master 7 like it was the Kanuma <laughs> Tatara. <laughs> oh my god. No way. Look at them. The walk of. Still have Elder up for another 20 seconds. Diego gonna go in and try to pick them all off. Starts off big. Gonna take out Maokai. Gonna take out Malphite with the two damage dealers. Are oh still my up. god. Swain living on with the chunk of his health, but Aphelios trying to pick him up, but he's gonna hold on. He's able to take off Swain. He's keeping oh, the game oh, alive. Oh, is up. Oh, a quadra kill from Joker, and he keeps them in the game. This is a desperation end. 14 seconds on the death timers and blue team is staring a 700-ish stack Nasus in the face. They're doing a good job at focusing the structures, but will it be enough? Effectivement, il va falloir focus les tours. 
Ouais, on a... Ouais, on, on veut fight ce... Euh, les gars, focus à tour, les gars. Ouais, en vrai, s'il focus à tour, c'est une fin de game. Ouais, les gars, l'inhibiteur, l'inhibiteur. Là, par contre, c'est pas une fin de game. Attention, les gars, hein. Les gars, euh, vous allez troll. Ils ont un peu troll, mais là, c'est ça, c'est ça. Oh, le... oh c'est close, hein. Mais euh, on a troll, hein, du côté d'Egypte. Red Team's bot lane has been picked off in the mid lane, possibly after taking away this mountain soul. It is a 5v3, but Darius and Wukong are looking extra unkillable, running into all five head first. We'll be looking to close this game out. The solar flare from Dos, not quite on mark, but they get to the stand aside onto Adis, and he will be taken down as well. Another kill in the pocket of LDLC. It has been clean, it has been clinical, and it has been an enormous game for the group favorites here from LDLC. We were hyped by the Yasuo. <laughs> but unfortunately, turns out Yasuo support, not really a thing. His, uh, his team find four kills and are taken down for the quadra kill. On to the Viego. Yike denied the Penta to close it out. 22 minutes on the clock. Exekick is oh going to lose his life as Golden Toast finds a triple kill. Doss, you need to end the game. Doss, eh? You can do it, Doss, I believe. He's got Golden Toast on him, though. It's a quadra kill for God. Keep an eye on Ezreal, or at least try to. This anime protagonist is running Dustblade, and it's like he's popping in and out of existence to clean up this attempt on ending the game. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> they're going for the Nexus turret. Okay, they're going for the jugular. Deathmark's going to go down, but again, the stasis is going to be available here. And Emma is up, so that's a lot of damage. Diego might be looking for against it. That's going to be one. Heartbreaker going to go down on one. Entity is going to be the next to fall. Double kill goes over to Emma. Kind of missed, kind of now as best he can. He tries to stop the onslaught of the Diego. Will it be enough, or is the triple going to go through? Aided and abetted by Kamikaze. No, it's not. The Chaos Storm, not enough. Minutes is just too huge in this game. Double kill returned on the side of who the hell is this? It's Glitchel Final. Don't forget the name. Oh, I'm gonna get shut down by the MF. They all overextend. And now the Mordecai are looking to trade over the kill, gonna secure the kill on the Amumu straight back to ancient Egypt. But it's still a double kill going over. truth tell me what's bothering you we know we're future proof we know we're future proof tell me the truth tell me what's bothering you we know we're future proof we know we're future proof oh Thanks so much for watching, that's going to do it for today's episode all on base defense. Remember to leave a like if you did enjoy, and subscribe for some more good stuff like this daily. Until next time, take care, stay safe, and have yourself a wonderful day.